Deciphering Grow Old Journey with Time. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving deep into a common English phrase that we often hear grow old. What does it mean, and how is it used? Let's uncover the beauty behind these two simple words. At its core, grow old refers to the process of aging or becoming older in terms of physical age. It's a natural part of life where humans move from being a child, to an adolescent, to an adult, and eventually to their senior years. Grow to develop or increase in size or amount. Old, having lived for a long time, no longer young. Combined, these words express the inevitable journey of life where every living being matures and ages. Beyond the literal interpretation, grow old can be used in various figurative manners. 1. Emotional or mental aging. Sometimes, People might say they feel old after a tiring day or after experiencing something mentally draining. In this context, it's not about physical age, but rather a state of mind or emotional fatigue. 2. Timeless affection. You might have heard the phrase, I want to grow old with you. This doesn't just mean living for many years side by side. It's a sentimental way of expressing a desire to spend a lifetime with all its ups and downs, with another person. 3. Objects and things. Sometimes, items or places are said to grow old if they're worn out, outdated, or not as effective anymore. For instance, my computer is growing old. It's becoming slower day by day. Understanding a phrase becomes clearer when we see it in action. Here are some sentences showcasing the use of grow old. 1. As we grow old, it's crucial to maintain a healthy lifestyle to stay fit. 2. This song will never grow old for me. It's timeless. 3. I hope to grow old in a countryside cottage surrounded by nature. The phrase grow old isn't just about counting years. It beautifully encapsulates the journey of life, the sentiment of timeless love, and the inevitability of change. We hope this deep dive helps you appreciate and use this phrase with greater understanding. Until next time, keep exploring the nuances of the English language.